What's up guys, this is Jay from Chat and Co. Um, this is one of my uh, previous fishing trips uh, that I made before. Um, I went for Fluke aka Flounder. Um, so let's check it out. So I was using the uh, 10 feet long rod with the reel that has 300 yard line that was like 10 pound and uh, 20 pound liter and spoon on it um, you know the spoon is like thin metal thing um, it's kind of easy to control in the water uh, from bottom to the top um, and I was utilizing slow retrieving method to see whatever it catches The reason why I was using the uh, slow retrieving method is that it doesn't devastate the situation and the environment in the water. Um, putting more actions sometimes um, put more pressures on the fish so it, they don't really bite those kind of crazy action lures. Um, but I kind of realized that um, it doesn't really help to catch anything out there at this time. So, uh, I started putting actions on spoon. So you see, I felt something was biting, but nothing was happening, and slow retrieving method at this time is not really working well. Um, so at some point I'm gonna put some actions on it and you'll see how it goes. So still nothing was happening, so I started using the uh, twitching method. It's like one, two, three, like quick jogging, and to attract fish. And let's see. Then I felt something heavy on the rod and reel. Then I was about to set the hook. So you see the fluke under the water. Um, it would be a really easy catch if I had a net, but I forgot it. Um, so I had to bring this back to uh, to the surf.
you see this beautiful fish flounder aka fluke um, what a crazy fish um, so look at the hook it was almost off um, anyway it was a good catch and fighting so here comes the uh, another fishing footage um, of a flounder aka fluke um, I was using the uh, uh, stop and go method and you'll see how it works So you see the thing in her mouth um, I was using the uh, jig head and a uh, plastic um, it sometimes works with only retrieving method so some people think that they only stay at the bottom so um, slow retrieving method or bottom bumping method could work out really well for them but I sometimes feel like they swim fast and prey really aggressively um, so uh, sometimes I retrieve fast to attract these fish um, they sometimes bite it um, but I still don't understand how I catch them and when I catch them um, like what I did and what I've done for them um, it's very tricky fish but it's fun to catch um, anyway if you like this video please like comment subscribe otherwise i'll see you guys on next video